they can expect to be amazed. Yep, the Amazing Spider-Man is heading to Kansas City in many different forms. There's a lot of Spider-Man to talk about and represent in this exhibition. It's, you know, more than 60 years now of this character. Patrick A. Reed is the co-curator of the High Flying Exhibit that will begin in Kansas City before traveling to LA. Because it's Union Station. It's a, I mean, it's a world-class venue. It's the jewel of the Midwest. Like, there's really no better place to do this. And because... There's a lot of connection that this character actually has to Kansas City. Yep, remember former Chiefs receiver Andre Risen, who was nicknamed Spider-Man? There was actually a comic book made for him, and it's one of the hardest, most valuable ones to find. There's the Andre Risen giveaway. There's a Kansas City Chiefs, uh limited edition Spider-Man comic from the 90s. There's even a Kansas City Jones department store from the 80s Spider-Man comic book out there. Over the years, there's a lot of little bits of Kansas City that have crept in, and you'll see those here as Easter eggs for sure. It's an exhibit that will start construction immediately right after the draft and open Memorial Day weekend. He's iconic. He was the original comic book, but he's about a person and an emotion. At Union Station, Alan Shope, KNBC 9 News. Tickets for the exhibit are on sale online at Unions and at Union Station. And again, that exhibit will open May 26th.